Oh my gosh, so close. So close. Now the question is, how long do I have to sit here watching it for it to turn to 10,000 subscribers? <gasps> wow, such a nice round number. 10,000. Thank you. Thank you so much. What an experience. I didn't have anything planned for like I didn't, I didn't plan on saying anything. I didn't have anything planned to say. I'm just really happy and I'm flattered and I'm grateful. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. I appreciate you being here and sharing your time with me. I hope that in some way I can bring value to you and your life and that we enjoy this little journey together. Oh, packages. you're going to get them to me? Okay. Welcome to the 10,000 subscriber edition of Mariah opening packages. This has to be a really fast edition because we are going to the playground to capture a little bit of the good weather. Olivia, please hand me the package. Thank you. <laughs> this one comes from Tourism Ljubljana. Oh. Oh, I love Ljubljana. And if you didn't know, Ljubljana literally means the city of love. I'm excited to get all these going and increase my experiences in Ljubljana. Because surprisingly, there's a lot of great things to see there. And I've always wanted to go. Thank you. Thank you, Tourism Ljubljana. Thank you for your thoughtful gifts. I appreciate it. The second gift here. The second gift. <gasps> I don't know what this is. <laughs> oh, very nice. Bibla Moya, Sasha Ausenika. What? Dear Mariah, you will always hit it off with Slovenians if you join them when they are listening to music or if you dance with them. In August 2018, we will have a three-week tour in USA and Canada. A few concerts will take place in California. So if you will be there, we will be there. Oh, I wish I could say I would be there, but probably I will be here in Slovenia because actually I have family coming here in August. Because we really like your vlogs and your will to learn Slovene, we would like to help you with some good Slovenian, that's a long word, narodno zabalno glaspa. <laughs> so we prepared a small package for you. Our latest album, our hat to keep you warm, free entry to recently renovated Ausenik Museum. Oh! We hope to see you in the future at one of our concerts or a Veselica. I love Veselica. I love going to Veselice. I think it's the most amazing thing. Regards, Matiz, Ensemble, Sasha, Ausanika. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. Recently renovated, the Ausanik Museum gives you a unique view into the works of Vilko and Slauko Ausanik. Wow, thank you. What a lovely gift. I will absolutely come to your museum. See this? SashaAusenik.com. Check them out. 
They're also on Facebook and on Instagram. Thank you! And thank you for joining me on this special 10,000 edition of Mariah Opening Packages. It's time! Well, this is our 10,000 subscriber celebration champagne that we've been holding out on. We never really had a chance to have it, and then at one point I said, are we going to have that champagne? And Lucas said, why don't we save it for when you hit 10,000 subscribers? And we did. <laughs> yeah, well, I think you did it. I don't think uh, I can really count myself to All right. adding that much. But I will <laughs> gladly take some of the cream of it, I guess. Okay. Glad, I... Glad to be a part of it. Sorry, that's what I'm going to say. Yeah. I'm glad you are a part of it. I think everybody else is glad you're a part of it. You yeah. have... You have some fans out there. I think the most common things I see regarding you is that Luca looks like PewDiePie. <laughs> You're a Slovenian PewDiePie. <laughs> That's funny. I think it's a compliment. It I is. I take it as such. Yeah. Um, and then, what else do people say about you? They do say that you tend to look kind of bored. Yeah. It's only because on video, I look normal. I don't know what to do with myself. It's not my channel. I try to be the best I can be, and I'm always thinking about things. When she's doing stuff, and she's like level 10, <laughs> and I'm level 3. It's usually late in the evening anyways. I've had a long day usually, putting the kids to bed and everything. And we do something, we record something, and I think I just kind of enjoy being on the sideline. And if I was just sitting in the room and she was being recorded, I think that would be a perfect backdrop. But because I just sit next to her and I, I don't do anything, I just kind of stare at gaze. <laughs> I just look high or tired or very sleepy, but it's ultimately I'm just enjoying being part of it. Um, I think that's what it is. I think it's a now good you know. <laughs> Yeah. I can see how that would be difficult. Like if you're not the one running the show, it's not like I have a script. There's no script, guys. There's nothing And that's the written. problem. It's like I have it all in my mind how it's going to go. But I obviously don't have a meeting with him before I shoot this. And yeah. The way it usually is. Are you going to be my vlog? But this is a testament to you and your work. Thank you. I guess I should say something. <laughs> this is so stupid, but I feel like I should like have some kind of speech or something nice to say and then like pop the champagne for dramatic effect. No. I just want to say thanks. Look at that. You're not my server. I can't. I'll laugh too hard doing it. Uh. Champagne is my favorite alcoholic beverage, I suppose you could say. Like, it's the classiest. It's like, it's, I just, it's so enjoyable for me. It's so fancy. I think if I were an alcoholic drink, I would be champagne. Huh. Refined, but bubbly. Happy. I wouldn't. <laughs> we're a good match for that. You'd be cognac. That's right. Something like that. To 10,000 subscribers. Yeah, I'll say something. Fun fact okay. about Mariah. She loves having strawberries with the champagne. We have none. Fun fact about Mariah. Hates fruit and chocolate, which is very interesting. Yeah. Loves chocolate champagne and strawberries and champagne, but not chocolate with any fruit. I'm more okay with fruit, like chocolate dipped strawberries. That's more okay than the orange flavored chocolate. Some of you may be noticing. I got a new haircut. Yes, I did. I basically had a one hour window and I said, I'm going now or I will never get my hair cut. <laughs> and I just walked in and got my hair cut without an appointment. It's like a little bit shorter than I want it, but this was my thought. It's going to grow so fast anyways, and I don't have time to regularly go to the hairdresser. So I'll get it a little shorter and in like two weeks, it'll probably be where I want it to be. To 10,000 subscribers, incredible vision and potential positive impact on the world. Thank you. Doing a like formal toast is something Americans only do on weddings. <laughs> yeah, you're all the time. Speech, speech, speech. In Slovenia, speech. it's like every time people get together and drink, somebody's making a speech. I feel like oftentimes when people make achievements that they always say, yeah, that was great. And now like onto the next thing. And while I do want to grow and continue to grow, I think that that's always bothered me because it's, I've always felt like, can't you just enjoy what you've accomplished without having to force yourself to like 
do more in this like in the same breath like can't you just for a moment reflect on what you've done right now i'd like to do just that and reflect on every each and every 10,000 of you who are out there watching um, and who subscribe because more of you watch than are subscribed. So thank you to those who subscribed and said that you want to continue to watch and be notified that <laughs> I'm doing something. And I hope that I really bring value to your life and that we bring value to your life. And that's what makes me really happy about the number 10,000. Cheers. Cheers. Thank you for watching this video. If you liked it, please like it. If you liked me and Luca and you want to be a part of this 10K club, then by all means, hit that subscribe button. <laughs> Join the posse. And as always, I will see you tomorrow.